The soaring number of great white sharks. A new report out today with a revealing portrait along America's coastline. ABC's Matt Gutman, who has taken a swimming with the sharks before on the new numbers and the effort to tag them and what those devices attached to the sharks are already revealing. A new report tonight shows a boom in great white sharks. Since 1997, the white shark population has increased by an estimated 42%. Most of summer shark sightings between Massachusetts and New Jersey. In Great Whites, nature created the perfect Hollywood nightmare. A truck-sized fish up to 7,000 pounds and 23 feet long, fast as a horse, and armed with 300 flesh-slicing teeth. Scientists crediting their resurgence to an increase in their favorite food, seals. A federal ban on hunting great whites and conservationists effort to change their image. The whole world needs sharks in order to keep our, our oceans healthy. I splashed in with Jim Abernathy to swim with tiger sharks in the Bahamas. Turn around, man. Turn around. Turn around. Wow. About as big as great whites, even petting them. The charm offensive is working. Scientists put a geo tracker on a great white they named Catherine, tracking her journey from Cape Cod to the Gulf of Mexico. She now has millions of fans following her online. And of the thousands of sharks out there, at least we know where one of them is. Catherine, all 2,300 pounds of her has been spotted, headed towards the Florida panhandle, so swimmers beware. But no, this isn't the movies. On average, there is only a single great white shark attack every year. David. And that is good to know. Matt Gutman on the beach tonight. Matt, thank you.